So I'm done charging and we have our first order of the day. DoorDash double order. Two items, 11 miles, $15. Went inside, the order was ready, good at Uber Eats. Bingo! Like I said, the drop off is only like 5.2 miles away and it's $13. So, I made it to the motel. So, I just dropped off that delivery and guess what? We ended up getting paid pretty much $33 for that delivery. We got a $27 tip. Okay, How you doing? Yes, I have an Uber Eats pickup for Logan. Okay, I do have one question. So you know I'm always telling you guys about um, electric vehicles, Teslas, not only is it great for the environment, zero gas, zero maintenance, and the car gets better over time with software updates. Tons of games to play, which is insane. And they also have a theater. We can watch Netflix, Hulu, YouTube, Twitch. To my dude, Derek, congratulations, brother. You just reached 8K today. Absolutely amazing, my brother, aka Chocolate Hawk in the building. I said my dude Chocolate Hawk is in the building, you young punk. Side lane. Side lane. What up, world? It's your boy Zilla. Thanks for joining your boy Zilla on this ride along ride with Zilla. Doo -doo, doo -doo. Riding with Zilla. Doo -doo, doo -doo. As you know, on this channel we do all apps Grubhub, Postmates, Uber Eats, Amazon Flex, Instacart, and even that thing they call DoorDash. Our goal is $100 for the day, maybe even two. Make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. Let's go get this paper. So, we're starting a day off at the Tesla Super Charging Station. I forgot to charge up last night at the house, so we're currently at 76%, 12 minutes remaining until we go get this paper. So I'm done charging and we have our first order of the day, DoorDash double order. Two items, 11 miles, $15. You know what? Nah, I think we're gonna pass on this one. Two items, 11 miles, $15. I think we can do a little better than that for the first delivery. All right, so we end up getting our first order on Uber Eats. It was $13.26 for five miles from a restaurant, Lazy Dog. Most likely, it should be a larger tip. I'm assuming, I think it's like five items. So let's see. See, it paid off. Went inside, the order was ready, good at Uber Eats. Bingo! Like I said, the drop off is only like 5.2 miles away and it's $13 and I believe 32 or 20, 20, I believe it's $13 and 26 cents for 5.2 or 5.3 miles. Anyways, let's go drop off this first delivery. First order of the day, guess what? We're about to deliver to a freaking motel. Hopefully everything go nice and smooth. So, I made it to the motel. Just dropped that order off, it was super easy, hand off. The young lady actually met me in the parking lot. That's what your boy talking about. You know your boy, no dead mouse. So heading back, we got the DoorDash order, I believe $10.75. Shakey's for 3.6 miles. Whatever you do, if you can, avoid no dead mouse, heading back towards home base. So these are the three items we're picking up from our dude, Anthony. Hopefully it's ready by the time we head inside. You guys have a Shakey's where you live or it's just an LA thing? I believe they're pretty much everywhere, if I'm not mistaken. Just picked up the goodies. Have these both large Grubhub bags. My dude Anthony ordered the entire restaurant. I think it's four pizza boxes in here and a bunch of pasta, potato wedges, chicken in that bag. Anyways, my dude Anthony is 2.3 miles away. This is a pre-COVID. Hand it to me. So I just dropped off that delivery and guess what? We ended up getting paid pretty much $33 for that delivery. We got a $27 tip. I told you guys they ordered the whole restaurant. I appreciate the tip, my dude, Anthony. However, we're like 8.5 miles away from home base. So we got to find the order heading back towards home base. Once again, shout out to my dude, Anthony. I appreciate the tip, my brother. So heading back towards home base. Guess what? Grubhub decides to join the party. We have an $8 order heading back towards home. Home base, no dead mouse, $8 order and then drop off. It's maybe 
I'm assuming total three to four miles. $8, I'm assuming three to four miles. However, there's no dead miles. Heading back towards home base. Let's go get this place. This is what we're picking up from my dude, Sean. I just made it to the restaurant. Hopefully it's ready by the time we head inside. Only two items, so it should be ready. Just picked up the order. Everything was ready. They head to the drop-off. Like I said, I think the drop-off is only one mile, if that. Maybe one mile, 1.2 miles. Easy drop-off, $8. Like I said, I have to do it because I don't want any miles heading back towards home base. My dude, Sean, is actually point six miles away so i was a little off point six miles drop this off to my dude sean however my dude sean stays in the apartment complex you know that can go hit or miss. all right so that last order it wasn't an apartment complex it was actually i delivered to another restaurant the young man met me outside so it was a perfect handoff as i was doing that we got a double order once again uber eats i believe it was twelve dollars 62 cent for a grand total of maybe 3.2 miles so I'm about to pick up the first order right now. Double pickup. I Uber could eat. be wrong, but I think both restaurants are in the same complex. I know for sure what one is, but the other one, I'm not 100% sure. But I think, once again, I think they're both inside the same complex. Hopefully, we'll see. Just secure bag number one. And the second place I have to go to is the ice cream place. I have to see where it's at. But I think it's around the corner. But I'm gonna drop this off to the car, put it in the hot bag, and then go get the ice cream. Just jumped off the first order, now I'm back. I'm about to look for the cold stone. I'm getting my steps in today. Um, the app said it's pretty much walking distance, so I'm assuming it's right around the corner of this complex. Just picked up the second bag. Bingo! First customer is only 0.8 miles away. This is a no contact. Please leave that front door delivery. Lucky the first drop off is the ice cream. So it'll be nice and cold when my girl gets it. Alright, so I just dropped off that last order and guess what? It was at a dealership. The young lady met me outside. Good lord. My girl Monique was absolutely gorgeous. Anyways, as I was dropping that off to my girl Monique, Uber Eats shows up again, I believe $12 for 4.5 miles. Just picked up the order. Everything was ready, so that went inside. Just dropped off that last order. Everything went A-OK. -okay. The young lady actually met me outside, which was absolutely amazing. As I was delivering that, Uber Eats shows up again, I believe $10. 51 cent for a grand total of 3.1 miles. So I'm here at the restaurant now. Hopefully, everything is ready for my dude Adam. Picked up the door. Everything nice and tight inside the grub pub bag because the Uber Eats bag was a little too small. Anyways, my dude Adam is 1.7 miles away. This is a no contact. Please leave that the front door delivery. Drop off that last order. Everything went amazing as I was delivering that. Guess what? Uber Eats once again. We have a double pickup. I believe it was $17.71 for a grand total of maybe 4.2 miles. So my restaurant number one. And then we're gonna hit the Rubio's after this. Yo, Uber Eats is showing out. Uber Eats the MVP so far today. Uber Eats keep getting these back-to-back -back orders non-stop. Actually, all the apps are going off. Even DoorDash and Grubhub have to decline so many orders. Just picked up order number one. Now it's time to get order number two. Went inside, the order was ready. Small drink, like kids drink. There's the food. Like I said, it was total, I believe, $17.62 for 4.2 miles. I thought those two orders, everything went amazing. As I was delivering that, guess what? Uber Eats, once again, I believe $9.34 for a grand total of three miles. Del Taco. So I just made it to the drive through and um, hopefully the line isn't too long. It's maybe three or so cars in front of me. Hey, 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 hey. 
How you doing? Yes, I have an Uber Eats pickup for Logan. Okay, I do have one question. Uh, um, so on his order, it's for the we have the Chick-fil-A burger, and then we have two of his uh, like little shakes. We don't have the proper drinks anymore. Like we don't sell them anymore. Got you. Um, um so. Like, I don't know if you would, if you can like text him and ask him if he wants like a little shake or something. Um, yeah, I can try that. Okay, thank you. I still can pull forward though, correct? Yeah, of course. All right. Thank you. So that was interesting. Let me text my boy Logan and see what's the deal, yo. So I text my dude Logan and he said he'll take a, a chocolate shake as a replacement. Got that last Uber Eats order. Everything went amazing. Everything's going to fire right now. So I need a little break. You know, I've been running around doing all these deliveries. First of all, I need a bathroom break. And then I might need something to snack on. I haven't ate all day, so hopefully we can find something to snack on. Maybe in the food court. I'm about to head to Costco to use the restroom. So maybe the food court at Costco. bathroom break is over so I end up getting a smoothie which is absolutely amazing and a slice of pizza pepperoni pizza underneath that foil absolutely amazing so you know I'm always telling you guys about um, electric vehicles Tesla's not only is it great for the environment zero gas zero maintenance and the car gets better over time with software updates but during downtime we need something to snack on there's tons of the game look at all these games Tons of games to play, which is insane. And they also have a theater. We can watch Netflix, Hulu, YouTube, Twitch. So I'm about to watch a little bit of um, YouTube, eat my snack, quick 15, 20 minute break, and head back to these deliveries. Watching my dude, Derek. Congratulations, brother. He just reached AK today. Absolutely amazing, my brother, AKA Chocolate Hawk in the building. I said my dude Chocolate Hawk is in the building, you young punk. Side lane. Side lane. All right, so break is over. Break was absolutely amazing. Anyways, you have another order. Good old Uber Eats, $9.12. Outback Steakhouse. I believe it was $9 for 4.1 miles. Hopefully it's a bigger payout since it's a pretty fancy restaurant. Let's get it. All right, you guys, so I dropped off that last order that was officially the last order of the night. Thanks for riding along with your boy Zilla. Ride with Zilla, doo -doo, doo -doo. Ride with Zilla, doo -doo, doo -doo. Let's see if we get a goal of $100, maybe even two. However, yo, I'm still thinking about my girl Monique from earlier. That's right, Monique, your boy is still thinking about you. Good Lord, Monique was looking gorgeous. She had the hair done, the nails, the outfit, the skin tone. I see you, Monique. I appreciate all the females that switch up their hairstyles. Shout out to my girl, Dimps, always switching it up. Let's gig it, always switching it up. And my girl, Journey with T, always switching it up. Your boy, Zilla, I see you, young ladies. Keep up the good work. Anyways, let's see how much money we made today. Do, 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 do. Made today. Hey, and as you know, we round up on this channel. So on that thing they call Uber Eats, $92.37. $93 Uber Eats. Grubhub, $8.13. $9 Grubhub. And that thing they call DoorDash, $105.73. $106 DoorDash for a grand total, $208. 
We hit our goal for the day. Hey, hey, we hit our goal for the day. Hey, hey. $208. That's what your boys are talking about. Hope you enjoyed the ride along. I enjoyed your company. Now, as always, make sure you like, subscribe, share, comment. I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.